Okay, the last thing was a bit confusing. So I will do the SFM thing again. So uh, what you have to do is just go to Steam library. Uh, it's Dutch for me, so library. Put your code in whatever it is, if it's in there. Okay, what you gotta do is go to the store. Search for source. And you will see it pop it up. Just download it. So while it is download, oh my god. While it is downloading, you go to community workshop. There you go. Soar. Soar. And you will already find source filmmaker. Find source filmmaker. And you will see models. And then, and then you search again. And then you search Fortnite. And then you will find Fortnite thingies. You can go ahead and. Oh my god. Get the fuck. <laughs> No, when 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 you when you're when you're in when you're in when 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 you're a source filmmaker, you can uh, you may uh, may have this. Uh, don't change this. It's nothing. Um, okay, so I made it work finally. Oh my god! So what you want to do is uh, if you have downloaded uh, some Fortnite skins. It's basically how you do it, it's just uh, press this little plus button, just like that, and it's downloaded, or just go, just click on it and subscribe, just like I just did, pretend with the plus button, um, oh my god, and then it's downloaded like, just like that, and then you go like, yes, and then you go like, okay, and then you go like, the plus thingy, model, uh, what, what is it from, again? Roadie, so we want to look up Roadie. That's a bit, that's a bit uh, sketchy, or how do I say it? It's a bit dumb right here because you have to look up the name, the creator, and you cannot press R on your keyboard, so it's like E. You hear that? So you have to go through the. There you go. And you uh, then you open it. And you'll see this is this is the model, and it's a bit dark. Wait, let me just, just put, oh, come on, just like that. Come on, come on, yeah, that's it. Uh, if you have selected the model, just just click on it. You can drag it anywhere you want. Look, look at that, yeah, and. Basically, uh, if it's too small, the character, or too big, that's a problem. Nah, it's, a, it's not a problem, because you can just scale it down. When you want to scale the character down, you can't just do that right here. You have to go to Spark Specialist and open it up. You go to Body, you go to Root Transform and Add Scale to Transform, whatever. And then you click this and... Uh, with left my left mouse button, and then you just drag it just a little bit, and like that. But what you want to do is hold control, left control on your keyboard, and you cl left click when you're holding a bone. You see, beautiful. Then you just do like that, and then you just do like that. And then you drag her down. Then you want to look. Is she fitting?
don't, if you want, select this thingy and just choose not output file. Now, oh yeah, so uh, I, I put my folder in downloads and you want to just click that, select that and just uh, change this name to uh, K guess and that's just perfect let's go um, an export poster that will render the render will take some time and after you've rendered you have your nice image you can just uh, after you've done this you can just mess around in Photoshop but I won't do this on camera because yeah, it's only an SFM tutorial so, uh, I guess I'll see you guys very, very soon. Later.